With New Zealand Music Award nominations up the wazoo and a hit record that's marketed itself, the talent of fellow Avondaleites, Tom and Haz is undeniable. Enough said, take a quick look at this. Yellow snap, uh, two face blue top, uh, sitting at the bus stop, uh, head spinning to this rock spot, high until the job's done, cause you only got one. We all die, there ain't no God, son. So burn it up till you got none. So turn it up until the cops come. What you want, Ken? Sell those snap pump. True face like a sox tongue. Sitting in the parking lot. Please welcome Tom and Hans from Homebrew, ladies and gentlemen. Hey! We had a clap for me. Yeah, absolutely. We're coming, for you, for, me. We're coming for you guys. for you guys. Uh, why don't you explain now to the country, homebrew, for those who have no idea, well, it's hard to believe, who you guys are, where you come from, Tom? Christian, Christian rock group. Um, <laughs> <laughs> parachute for six years now. Yeah, trying to get that parachute money, actually. We're not a Christian rock group, but I'm trying to get some parachute money. So. Awesome. So you... Uh, are Ruby Frost's mum. <laughs> <laughs> How's it feel to be, like, the saviours of hip-hop? Like, you took an album to number one. I you? didn't see it as, like, us being saviours. I just see it as, like, us being normal and just, like, releasing music that, like, how we feel. Yeah. Mm. Totally. So it's honest. Uh, I guess so, but I don't think like we're saving anybody's lives. Savior is good though. Yeah, I mean it feels. Put good that on my CV. <laughs> yeah, totally. I, 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 okay, then Savior put, put superhero on my CV. Like as superhero. Yeah. Do you have to have Dave Jobs, um, or are you kind of like? I hope not. All right. I mean, I don't, but benefit. I would never mainly. like to. Work for that. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. Now, Awa, you've worked with uh, one of these guys in the past. Yeah, yeah, you? yeah. Well, um, for a lot of people that don't know, Tom is an extremely good b-boy. We used to break dance together back oh, in the day at Youth Town. Wait, 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 wait. I don't know his b-boy name. B-boy Dizzy. <laughs> my man, wow. and um, yeah, it's sewn on my shirt. Over here. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, yeah, we used to uh, frequent uh, Youth Town. Uh, we love that place. Uh, yeah, Tom was one of the youth leaders there. And, um, but the boys have done really well. Uh, number one album, as you said, hip-hop was kind of in a bit of a slump and the boys really, it was like a breath of fresh air for yeah. the industry. Yeah. And you guys are like kind of, I don't know if you pioneered the do-it-yourself type thing, but you guys literally are your own little unit, aren't you? Quite tight, making it happen without big corporate influences. I guess so. No one else would help us, so we just had to do it ourselves. Yeah. You know? mm. It's like a necessity, I guess, you know? So yeah. anything evolves, I guess. Cool. Kayleen? But isn't it true you guys said that you didn't want your songs played on commercial radio? Yeah. I don't think our song has been played on commercial. I mean... You didn't want it played on commercial radio, though? Nah, because, you know, they just play the same thing. I don't want to sound like a bitter old man. But they, <laughs> like, as far as I see it, they play the same thing every day in the same format, three yep. minutes, 30. And this is how, like, people get... Like, you can't digest any other kind of music now yeah. because of that. So yeah. like my little cousin has to listen to this shit about in the club, in the club, shake your ass, it's all about money, it's all about this. And you know, like, even though our music hasn't got the most moralistic, like it's not the greatest, <laughs> yeah. you know, but still it's creative. Like yeah. we, we, we uh, try to talk about being yourself and doing something different. Yeah. But as far as I see it, commercial radio, just same old stuff, you know, tried and tested formulas. Just like movies and yeah. just like So you saying your, TV your sound other than this one. Your sound doesn't quite fit into the commercial radio box. I hope not. Right. And that's what you don't want. It's kinda like we don't mm. want to dumb our music down. Like we made it like this. We don't want to make it like this, like had to rearrange like yeah. There's an art to making a pop song though. Yeah. For sure. Yeah. Like definitely respect like you know, Lady Gaga's songwriters and shit like that. Mm. You know, they know yeah. how to make a catchy you know, a hook is supposed to be a hook. Yeah. Like, we're still trying to make catchy music, mm. but just trying to make something a bit different. Yeah. Well, but anyway, but enough about that. You guys have that. been really, really successful, though, in, in your music, obviously, because you've been nominated so many times for the Vodafone New Zealand Music Awards. Congratulations. Which out of the five categories that you guys have been nominated are, is the one that you're most determined and you really, really want to get? The one Kimbra's not going to win. <laughs> nah, hip hop, hip hop. Like, for me, hip hop, man. Like, yep. For us, hip hop. Yeah. yeah, we just wanted to win Best Hip Hop Album. That was pretty much like our. Cool. Like at the start of the year, um, our manager was like, What's it going? I was like, Who want a Tui? <laughs> we want a Tui. <laughs> like, we, actually, we actually wanted a Tui. Like, that was our goal. Do you guys so, look up to, to anyone? Cool. Do you look up, up to anyone inwardly in New Zealand or do you have Definitely. overseas? Who are they? Oh. Nah, you know, like all those dudes, like, you know, I came up on Damn Native, Shea Fu. Mm -hmm. uh, um, King Caps, and now you know, can call the dude and say, Shay, you want to go play ball or something? You know, it's yeah, crazy. Nice. Like, awesome, man. Yeah. Awesome. It's crazy. How do you know when you've actually done it and you're actually gone? It's not, you don't, when you're actually living your dream and your the fantasy of when you. How do you know if you've made it? 
I, this I don't was think in the green I've, room. I've made it yet. <laughs> you got the apple. <laughs> you got the it. apple. I got water. Where's the apple, baby? <laughs> <laughs> Fantastic. Okay, let me get on with he you guys. Re- you got the catch. He actually bought some for you. He's got some in the Unbelievable. pocket. Unbelievable. All right. Oh. You guys eat those. We'll be back in a second with uh, with Haz and Tommy. Ah, <laughs> oh, yes, yes, yes. Man, you are uh, back with Aotearoa Social Club. I'm Thank Kubi, our guest tonight, mm. Tom and Haz from Homebrew. Yeah. Guys, welcome again. Look at that. Um, tell me, who looks after your business affairs? I mean, half of you don't think you no get a cell does, phone man. charged. My mum. So your mum does. <laughs> Seriously. She's just pretty tight with the money, you know, pretty due with it. Yeah. I, I got a good friend that's like a sound engineer at TVNZ. Who... Yeah. Isn't he doing the sound for this? That's yeah. our manager. Is that your manager? Yeah, Glenn. Substance, Glenn? Glenn. Glenn Substance. There you go. <laughs> Mr. Davison. Doesn't, doesn't your mum work Glenn for TVNZ Jeanette. as well? Yeah, she does. There you go. So Great I got on the show. Wow. And the Māori programs. Very good. Very good. Shout out to Marae Investigates. Hey, uh, that Sunday, Sunday mornings. Awesome. <laughs> Trying to push the ratings for that show, actually. This show is out doing it. Uh, you guys have a new label? Or are you working on a new label? Um, no, our label is Young, Gifted and Broke. This is a thing. Nice. Go, go, give it, give it a walk, bro. Yeah. Go walk model that out. Model it. You can get... This is my camera. model, go Tom. Oh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah. yeah. Perfect. What you know about that New Zealand fashion? Wanna, I'm what do you know about that Flynn on his face? What do you know about that? Well, man. Hey, uh, um, yeah, that's our label, but um, yeah, we got all our boys under it. Team Dynamite, At Peace. Yeah. Um, yeah. Side steps, everybody. Yeah. And the boys are keeping busy too. You fellas are off to gig in Australia, two of you? Yep. Get that act we're in, of money. We're in Oz like in two weeks, and in December we're, we're doing a whole tour through there. We just made a tape to promote over there. A tape tape. Yeah, because they tape. love tapes, you know, like Jimmy tape. Barnes and all that kind of stuff. <laughs> they into that. I don't think they got CDs over there yet. I guess it's like <laughs> everyone owns a ute and they don't have a CD player. They got yeah. the tapes. Got the tape Either the A-track or the tape deck. Tom, yeah. talk to me about At Peace, please. Uh, At Peace is another group of ours. It's um, me, myself, and uh, Louis Tuiasau and Christoph Altrinton. <laughs> it's like just maybe... The other side of our personalities, you know, it's not so much about drinking and stuff like that. You know, the kids love to hear that, but mm. every now and then we think of some other stuff. Like I can actually spell philosophy. Yeah. So it's kind of like what soulful, jazzy, that kind of sound. I is guess it? so, man. Yeah, yeah. Every, you know. I see it as Hip hop's always like jazzy because it's mm. it's future. Like we've made it like, in the future. Yeah. Oh, I got this is what they do in the future. Yeah, it works through. No, Perfect. yeah, it's just, it's just another side to our personality. I think every like artist needs different ways to vent. Or else yeah. you get pigeonholed, you pigeonhole yourself. You know? One, one so last that. question from Kaylee. Uh, you've been cutting your hand up. Oh, yeah, what's the ultimate goal for Homebrew? What's the ultimate goal? Where do you guys want to go? Where do you see yourselves from like five years from now? That's it. Actually, like. Not in rehab? Um, I might have a drink of water. <laughs> it's a hard question. <laughs> <laughs> we'll pass that to Tom. I think just making music, to be honest. Yeah. Like, just as, as long, long as we like, keep making music. Yeah, yeah, huh? Like, as long as we're making music every day, like. That's the, that's the dream. There's like, no way we. That's the most Nobody serious answer us. you guys But it's for real, like, <laughs> music is the best thing in the world, you know? It's like the way you can communicate mm. anything you want to say. It's the best medium, like, for someone that's got problems. You know, I can say, oh, I feel shit. If it rhymes, people are like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Buy that. Yeah, and uh, do you have time to go to the movies or anything like that? You know, take time out, take a girl nah, to the movies? I, go I, got, I got more time to download movies. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm well, sorry, I'm I sorry. I'm not the the show, man. Yeah, no, honestly. Pirate, <laughs> Pirate Bay, man. Pirate Bay. Do date nights and things like that. If you want to pay for a movie, why don't you go and see All Jackie Cougar? Like, if you pay for a movie, um, you go into the movies and like people are like, eh, eh, eh. Right. Germs, man. It's all about. Yeah. Let's <laughs> keep on <laughs> man. Cut to me, everyone. Cut I'm to sure, me. Germs, like... that's a whole. Here's, you yeah, mentioned don't... about downloading movies and what have you. Talk to me. What's your problem with movies? Why are you going to the cinema? I actually and buy don't have the internet in my house, but when I do have internet, I love to download it. Right. It's just like I get the feel of the movie before I actually try and take mm. somebody to the movies. Yeah. But then again, like, I do not like going to the theatres. People you know, don't know about Germs, that. man. Germs. Ice cream count in the theatre, man. Or <laughs> ice cream count. Magic four rows. Right. You don't this know. Is, this, is the, this is the cup I bought from the movies. Yep. Oh, it's wet. It's wet. <coughs> Put it in Are the you, cup holder. Aren't you getting a new cup? No. Nah. Oh, you're talking about the cup holder. You guys, you hip-hop guys are badass, I'll tell you. Put it on your hand, put it on your cup, like, yeah. putting it back in. Tom, can you tell me, what are your favourite movies? You got a <laughs> favourite movie? You got a favourite genre? Gotta be Big Lebowski, yeah. old boy. Sharing and Join is different, because, like, <laughs> it's you're with your friends, you <laughs> know? <laughs> you know, you're with your friends. Has but... you have a favourite movie, just while you're here? <laughs> right now? Yeah. 
I like that kingdom, uh, is it Moonshine Kingdom? Oh yeah, it was oh, cool. Yeah, like, it's a good one. It's pretty cute. It, it, it yeah. kind of made me feel like, oh, I want to go and be adventurous with like this little guy with the glasses. Excellent. Thank you very much. <laughs> now we know. Welcome back to Aotearoa Social Club with guests Tom and Hans from Homebrew. I uh, have got on good authority that um, Tom, you've got a little bit of a top five that I've got the pleasure of reading out. Some yeah, of your you sentimental spot, songs, man. Yeah? Top five songs. That's a hard one. That is a tough one. I'd rather do like top five family members. What, you didn't get my text on top five producers? Yeah. I'm gonna, you got to chuck two in to start with. Okay, we got, here they are anyways, the top five songs from Homebrew's Tom, uh, Nas and Memory Lane. Uh, in at number four, Curtis Mayfield hey, and Stone Junkie. My dad. Number three, De La Soul and Falling. Uh, Tyrone Bronson at number two and The Tune. That is a track. My man. And number one, The Meters, Be My Lady, which is kind of sentimental for you, Tom. I'm going to play that at my wedding, for sure. Oh. Even if it's just me. I do, yes I do. Can I just say, very good luck, very good luck at the New Zealand Music Awards uh, for all the nominations. We're going to leave our guests Tom and Hans with their music video. This is Yellow Snot, ladies and gentlemen. Have a look. Love this too. It's good. Yeah, it's got the real shit, bro. Oh, no, no. 